what you're thinking. What did Callie get herself into now? Well, I've been thinking a lot about what it means to be a messenger. Do you know what a messenger is? A messenger is a person who carries a very important message. That made me think, what important message do I have for others? What do I really want people to know? So I thought about it and came up with three things. Number one, koalas are really cool animals. I mean, look at them. I see a koala and I just want to snuggle with them. Don't you? But that didn't really seem important enough. So I thought some more, okay? Number two, orange juice and sports drinks do not mix. You think they would, right? They should, but they don't, friends. But that also didn't seem important enough. And then it hit me. Of course, it had to be this. Lucky number three, Jesus loves you. He really does, a whole lot. That seemed like a very, very important message. It seemed like the most important message. So then I started to think about how to get that message out to everyone. Cards! Have you ever received a message in a card? It's the best! So I made 10 cards, but I couldn't stop there, so I made more, then more, then more, then more! Am I ever going to deliver all these cards to everyone with this very important message that Jesus loves them? Let's check out our Bible story for today. Maybe it will give us an idea. It's time for today's Bible story. It comes from the book of Acts, chapter 16. There was a man named Paul. He did not like followers of Jesus at all. He would try to round them up and put them in jail. But one day, he heard Jesus speak to him. And from that day, everything changed. Paul was sent out by Jesus with a very important message. Paul's message was our big idea from last week. Do you remember? Jesus can deliver everyone. Some people thought it was just for a certain small group of people, but it wasn't. How was Paul ever going to deliver such an important message to all the people that needed to hear it. Well, one night, he had a dream. In the dream, there was a man standing on the shore of a very far off place called Macedonia. The man was calling for Paul to come and help him and the people there. When Paul woke up, he knew what he had to do. The best way to deliver this message was to get going and do it himself. He set sail for Macedonia and went to as many places as possible, delivering the message that Jesus can deliver everyone to whomever would listen. Not everyone received the message, but many did. There was a woman named Lydia who received the message from Paul and knew that it was true. Her belief in Paul's message was so strong that she shared it with everyone in her house. And they believed Paul's message too. Lydia and everyone in her house were so happy to receive this great message that they had Paul come be their guests at her house. This is how the message Paul was given to deliver spread everywhere in all directions. Everyone who received the message, like Lydia, became deliverers of it. So the message of Jesus began to spread around the world. Even though it might have begun with just a handful of people, God's message goes everywhere. I didn't have a dream like Paul or anything, but that Bible story really helped me know exactly what to do in order to deliver these cards that say Jesus loves you. I asked my parents if we could go around the neighborhood handing these out, and they said yes. We've been everywhere. I gave a card to my friend Pedro down at Jiffy Mart. I gave one to Miss McClune, our mail carrier. I've also given them to a lot of people that I didn't even know. Some people didn't want a card, and that's okay. One woman was so happy she almost cried tears of joy when she saw the message. Isn't that crazy? 
She said that she was going to show my card to someone else who needed to see it. Wow. If everyone I gave a card to showed it to someone else, then so many more people would hear the special message that Jesus loves them. I guess it's really true. God's message goes everywhere. Who can you tell today that Jesus loves them? You may think it's a simple and small message to deliver, but it's not. It's huge, and it goes everywhere. Thanks for learning and growing with me, friends. <laughs>